If you saw the news this week, you'd know that we are heading for a major crisis for biodiversity, the plants and animals that we value so much. I'm standing now in the biodiversity garden behind the buildings at Wageningen University in Research. This is biodiversity. It's the green, it's the plants, the trees, the birds, in the water and, and on the land. The biodiversity garden was over there and we've just moved the other side of the hedge and we're now on our farm. And here we are growing biodiversity because crops are biodiversity as well and there's biodiversity in the soil. Vitally important for food production and keeping us healthy and alive actually. And across our farm system, we're looking at different ways of managing the land in order to increase biodiversity and try to reverse some of the impacts that have caused the loss of these million species we were talking about earlier. And one of the fantastic results that we've had in recent years is that the partridge numbers, which were less than five pairs, have increased to over 20 now in this year, breeding. So now I've come in from the fields and much as I'd rather be out there, this is actually my natural ecosystem. Here is where we take the research that we've done out there and turn it into policy and practice. We help policymakers to target their funding to farmers in order that they can make some of the changes for wildlife sensitive farming that we've seen out in those fields. We can also help them to write business plans that are nature inclusive. And actually, that kind of process is a kind of magic and that's why we work here.